this movement. All of us are part of it. You know what I'm saying? We all have the potential to do what people who came before us necessarily did not do. That is a huge fucking burden on somebody's shoulders. Sometimes I get nervous at home in the crib when I think about the weight that's on all of our shoulders. But why would we sit here? Why the hell do we wake up for? What do we sign up for from the beginning? We knew what we was up against. So we just gotta thug it out. You know what I'm saying? We gotta thug it out. Some people, when you was in that car driving down south with those kilos in the trunk, nigga, there was a lot of weight in your shoulders then. You know what I'm saying? When you was on that stripper pole, you know what I mean? Doing what you do in front of all of those men who had the potential to do you bodily harm, it was a lot, it was the world, the world was on your shoulders then. You know what I'm saying? So if you could go, if you could flirt with death on a nightly basis, on a daily basis for fiat, then you can flirt with it for the freedom of your people and the uplifting of fallen humanity. That's right. That's right, get him, pill. Red pill, ready for all in the black radio. Please, Don Yala. And, uh, uh, and, and the brother, Eman Bashir. You know, if I may, I'm a just selfie bit. Court, Angel and Training TV, man. I love this brother right here. And you know, one thing about you know us from Harlem, we respect people who come through very well dressed. So I appreciate that too. Because it's not just about looking good, but it's about setting that example. You know what I'm saying? So thank you, brother. That's why I remember. When I see y'all together, man. No. No, sometimes trying to get you to be on the I think I'm going. I think I'm going to um, turn him down. You're going to ask him his nationality? Yeah, yeah, I'm going to turn him down. <laughs> because to me, yeah. I'll be honest with you, yeah.